Hey, can everybody hear me? Good. Okay, good afternoon. Well, I'm so excited that you are here and welcome to our transitional program. This is the class of Miss Kuhn slash Miss Chow and uh, Miss Navarre. So um, we have worked very hard for this for today and we're so excited to have you all here and we hope you thoroughly enjoy it. Um, first off, I would like to introduce our director and principal, Miss Washington. Good morning. Oh, it's afternoon. Good afternoon. Oh, let me say it one more time. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Thank you so much for being a part of um, today's program. Thank you so much for being a part of our year and our lives and allowing us to be a part of your child's uh, early learning years. Um, we have definitely had some transitions this year and we're really excited to see uh, the demonstration of learning that the students have been engaged in all year long. Uh, we always say that your child, uh, that you are your child's first teacher and we get to come along your side and help them to be all that um, you will see at this point and prepare them for kindergarten. So we uh, want to thank Ms. Navarre, Ms. Harris, Ms. Hope, Ms. Chow, Ms. Kuhn, um, for all that they have done this year to help get our children ready. Give yourselves a round of applause because definitely we could not do any of this without uh, your support. So I'm very confident that our children today will show you just a little bit about what they have learned and what they have done uh, this school year. So sit back, relax, and we'll come back at the end to do some closing remarks. Thank you.
You must stand for the pledge. All right, we're going to sing our first two songs. The first one will be I Love Who I Am, and the second one will be the alphabet song.
All right, guys, you may be seated. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to do our award and uh, diploma ceremony. And Miss Washington will be up there giving your child their diploma. And I will say the name followed by the award that your child received. So the first student that I have is Yanelli Alvarez Gatton. Her award is Number Recognition. Jarius Caesar, leadership. <laughs> German Diaz Hernandez, counting. Rashard Dorsey Mallet, number recognition. Alexander Fernandez Kaplan, counting. Naomi Henderson, counting and number recognition. Number of recognition. Khalil Lewis, all academic areas. Mari Mercer, counting, and she also got a library award for Miss Tebo. Isaac Morphin, handwriting. Denver Nelson, handwriting and letter recognition. Adriana Navo, counting. Letter recognition and counting. <laughs> Amina Sias, handwriting.
Jaslyn Valencia, Letter Recognition and Counting. Sandra Williams, Letter of Recognition. Elijah Gordon, All Academics. All academic. <laughs> Lucas Potus, all academic. All right, now I'll introduce our PE teacher, uh, Coach Riley, if he would like to come up and give his PE awards. Okay, this is high energy class number two. Okay, you know you kids are energetic. They're busy, busy, they like to run, they like to play. That's awesome. I get to choose three of these students to be my honorary PE coach. And with that, they get a certificate and they get to choose a whistle. And they're gonna bring it home and they're gonna blow that whistle all day long. But who's the lucky winner gonna be? The young lady I chose was a young lady, she got injured earlier in the year, so she really was my assistant coach for much of the year because she couldn't participate. So I gave her my electronic whistle. I gave her the, 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 the equipment to pass out to the kids, but she couldn't participate. But Miss Sandra Williams, come on over here, Sandra. She's healed up now, but for a long time. The young man I chose was someone that came a little bit later in the year. And let me tell you, it is not easy for a young guy at this age to come in in the middle of the school year and ask to make. It really isn't. And it was a big ask for this guy, but he came in and didn't miss a beat. And he just participated, started making friends. Mr. Kellyong Smith, come on down. <laughs> Kellyong. You're handsome. Hey, <laughs> Take a picture. Soccer ball, baseball, basketball, or football. Anything you like. Basketball. Basketball. And the young lady I chose for Miss uh, Child Miss Coon's class was Nova Osono. She's been with us for two years. She's moving up. 
And she is the best helper anyone could ever ask for. Come here, girl. Look at that smile. How could you not love this smile? Come here. And thank you, y'all. I appreciate you guys. I really do. All right. One thing that your children have learned this year is they have learned to sing um, or say sign language for the word thank you. So our next song will be a sign language song titled Thank You. two very special uh, slideshows that we've created throughout our year. Um, and now I will release the children and come sit by you in those little blue chairs so they can watch it with you.
so good in it. No bigger than a minute. How it amazes me. You're changing with every blink. Faster than a flower blooms. They grow up all too soon.
All right, well, this concludes our transition program. I hope you thoroughly enjoyed the whole thing. The slideshows always get me every year. And uh, so, anyways, um, before you leave, um, I would first off, I would like to say thank you so much for sharing your child with us. And um, also, before you leave, each of your children have their awards in a, a big envelope with their name on them. Also, grab a backpack. This includes some, um, some end-of-the-year presents that we got for them. So we hope they enjoy them throughout the summer. And um, if you plan on taking your child home, you will need a pass to do that that you can get from the office. So I'm going to let Ms. Reynolds, or Washington, excuse me, take over. Y'all give it up for Miss Navar, Miss Harris, Miss Coon, Miss Chow, Miss Hope. Uh, just been a phenomenal year of preparing our children. Uh, we've been in transition programs since the Thursday last week. So it's just amazing to see uh, the differences in all of the programs. All of the children in the programs take on their own personality each time. Uh, and Ms. Navarre pulled out some classics that almost took me out, but okay, Ms. Navarre. Uh, but anyway, one of the things that we like to uh, share with, uh, with you is that each year we have a, um, it's just a part of our portfolio, and it's our way of saying thank you for allowing us to be a part of your child's uh, early learning years. What you do uh, really does matter. The foundation has been laid. And as they move on to kindergarten and beyond, we want you to just have a little token to remember uh, your time here with us. Um, and as we always say, once you are part of Head Start, uh, part of Wheatley, you are part of our family forever. So if there's ever anything that we can do to support and help, please, um, uh, please feel free to reach out to us as well. So 
they are messy. And then we have one more special recognition. Um, this is the first time that this has been um, done uh, here. Um, our state representative, um, Christian Manuel, has acknowledged, uh, asked us to find three of our top students uh, in the school. Um, and it was a challenge as we looked at attendance data, we looked at academic data, we looked at uh, progress uh, for our students, and uh, we were able to select three uh, of our students. And Ms. Navarro's class has one student, and this reads, uh, and when, we, when I call your name, if mom, dad, um, whomever the child is here with will come up, um, and we will take a picture uh, for, um, for a, a state rep. The State of Texas House of Representatives Certificate of Recognition uh, to Callie Hinton. Congratulations on your outstanding achievement this year and the 2022-2023 school year. So y'all give it up for Callie as she's been a recognized. We're gonna go to the Senate by our state representative, Mr. Christian Manuel. Thank you so much, um, and to our state rep, it was just really an honor for him to, to do that. And in all of my 11 years, we have not had that done before, so it's definitely an honor. Um, as Ms. Navarre said, this is going to conclude our program. They have some items for you over there. Uh, if you are, well, it's, it's the end of the day, so you definitely feel free to take them home. Um, but we have, um, if you're taking them home, make sure that you have a pass on. Um, you can give the pass to the teacher and um, then we'll be able to be dismissed at that time. So give it up one more time for the future class of 2036. Give it up for them. Thank you so much, parents, for your support this year and all that you have done. Many of you have been with us a couple of years, so we really, really do appreciate you. We also want to acknowledge our uh, Ms. Jones, our education coordinator. She had, oh, she's in the back. Um, and then also to our technology department, Mr. Ballou, Mr. Raul, and Mr. Cabrera for really uh, helping us capture this moment. Um, and so this will be on our YouTube page so you can share it with family and friends, but it is a part of our uh, YouTube library. So again, thank you so much for all that you do, and I'm going to turn it over. I'm not sure how we're doing it. They just, huh? So they get backpacks from over there. Okay, so parents, if you will meet Miss Harris and uh, Miss Hope, and if you have a pass, they will give you a pass and will give you their items as well. <laughs>